Hey Cancer, I hope you're doing well. This is going to be a general reading for May 13th through the 16th. So this is for Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. That's just kind of what I've been doing over here on the channel lately, Monday through Thursday, then Friday through Sunday, and you know, of course, some random rounds of readings in between. I did post the weekend reading, the Friday through Sunday, for anybody who's interested. Those are up. They're posted, ready to go, okay? But um, yeah, Cancer, I also have a same-day reading going on right now. It's three questions. You get it within 24 hours after purchase. Now, this does end today, Thursday, May 9th at 3 p.m. Eastern time. So if you're interested, go ahead and get your hands on it. Everything's in the description box, okay? So we are going to go ahead and get started here. I wish these cards would stop sticking together today. Goodness gracious, what do we got here for cancer? Okay. We had a couple different cards wanting to pop. Goodness gracious, you guys have... I had six one to cut. Why not? You know, why not? Oh my goodness. Okay. Quite a bit there. That's an uneven amount that's going to bother me. Okay, let me get one more here. Okay, I put that on top. Very interesting. Ten of Cups is um, overall here. Ten of Cups, very happy card. Okay, this is a card of however you define emotional fulfillment. Two of Cups underneath that. I'm not even going to keep going on the deck like that. But, you know, it's definitely um, a really good energy up top here. So I'm pretty surprised by the bottom. Okay, um... Like, this is pretty crazy, Cancer. Like, this is wild because you have the star here. This is a wish being fulfilled. Like I said, that Ten of Cups being your overall was enough for me to feel that way because, you know, Ten of Cups is however you imagine emotional fulfillment, you know, and so that could be in the form of a connection. You know, it could be in the form of a vehicle, a home, because you have Four of Wands here. You have the Chariot, Four of Wands, Happy Home, Happy Family, the Chariot, a vehicle, or, you know, a move of some sort. And we have the Three of Cups here good community, like good vibes, you know, celebrating something here. You could be attending an event. I mean, four of wands and three of cups really could both say you could be attending an event or you're celebrating something or being celebrated. You know, the chariot here, the high priestess, you know, I feel like <laughs> I keep saying, you know, but seriously, I mean, I feel like your intuitive abilities are increasing and, you know, the chariot showing up right here. It's like, it's really good energy. It's like all new everything type of energy for you guys. And I really love that for you. But then you have on the bottom, like this wild energy, like you have um, the Knight of Swords and you have the Nine of Swords. So this is like stress, anxiety, grief, sleepless nights. This could be like defensive energy or even blame, envy. I mean, could be gossip for some, but really looking like envy. I'm not really seeing a whole lot um, being talked about here, but Four of Cups, you know, not being satisfied. Seven of Swords, trickery, theft, deception. This could be somebody who deceived you, Cancer. I just, I mean, I can't believe what I'm seeing here because it's like such good energy up top. And then I'm like, oh, let me just keep pulling. And we get all of that. It's just insane. You could have a Capricorn or a Gemini, like envious of you here, blaming you for something, potentially a Cancerian, Pisces, Aquarius. Yeah, I mean, or somebody with their moon, moon or Venus, or Mars in one of those signs here. Yeah, I mean, I just really feel like you're at peace. Like, I feel like you're living a new life here. Again, I just feel like there's just this brand new energy about you. Some of you, you could have moved already. Like, some of you, these changes that I'm talking about here, whether it's a move, a new vehicle, maybe it's like new wardrobe, new social circle, whatever the case may be, um, like a, a fulfilling job, I feel like you have achieve something really big and your energy is just brand new because of it you know you're at peace you're balanced you know and i feel like you're continuing to work on yourself protect yourself and it's not that you think everything is perfect i think that you know for a lot of you you're always improving and you know there could be this energy around you possibly from the past you know because it does look like there is this energy of blame here you know um like it's wild like the seven of swords is trickery theft and deception like i said like this could literally be somebody who deceived you kept secrets from you talked about you i mean knight of swords like literally blaming you in their head because they're missing out you know it's just insane here or they could be crediting themselves for what you're accomplishing here at Cancer. It's just crazy. It's absolutely mind-blowing here. But I feel like you're in a stable place. Some of you could be attracting an earth sign or it's Sagittarius here. This person could be in a very stable place as well. If they're not, don't settle for it, you know. And by stable, I don't mean that they have to be filthy rich. I just mean, you know, stable. Nobody's perfect, but just don't be crazy. Don't just be playing games for no reason, you know. Um, don't be like not having a job and have no desire to get a job, <laughs> you know. It's just, it's craziness. Have some ambition. You know, I feel like it's just really standard you know what I mean and so 
And that's what I'm seeing here, Cancer. I hope that this was helpful or fun. I mean, it was wild here, but it looks like really good things unfolding for you overall. Uh, details are down below, Cancer, for anybody who's interested in that deal I have on personals. Like I said, um, it's a three-question reading. You get it within 24 hours, and that does close today, Thursday, May 9th at 3 p.m. Eastern Time. So everything's down there if you're interested, of course. But Cancer, if this is where we part, thank you for being here. I really appreciate you, and hopefully I will see you next time. Bye.